suddenly a major concern in Alberta. For the first time since the early 1990s, the oil-rich province is in the red. Like most regions of the country, the economic downturn is taking a big bite out of Alberta's budget. So much so that the government is now projecting a massive deficit and thousands of layoffs. More from CTV's Janet Dirks. From a distance, it looks like the Emerald City, glittering Calgary, the biggest city in energy-rich Alberta. But the sheen is beginning to lose its luster. For the first time in 15 years, the province is projecting a financial loss, a deficit of more than $1 billion. Alberta's finance minister is even using the R word. It's a very bad word, isn't it, to think of a, a recession, but it, it, I think we are in a very sharp period of recession. Six months ago, an $8.5 billion surplus was expected when oil was $147 a barrel. That was at its peak. Now it hovers at $40 a barrel. The province is warning that 15,000 people will lose their jobs this year, that Albertans can't escape the relentless reach of the recession. We have been affected as other Canadians have. Well, not exactly. There is a sustainability fund of more than $7 billion that will help cover losses. There's also the Heritage Fund. It was set up 32 years ago by then Premier Peter Lougheed as a way to tuck away money from the boom times to cover the busts. But like so many investment portfolios, the Heritage Fund has lost money, $3 billion. Yet $14 billion remains in the Heritage Fund. It's not insignificant. The finances in Alberta are in very, very good shape compared to the rest of the country. Jobs the director of the Canadian Taxpayers Federation suggests I, Albertans know, have nothing to complain about. 15,000 jobs lost. I mean, that's, that's nothing compared to what's going to happen in, in the U.S. or in southern Ontario. Uh, we're in a, in a very, very good shape uh, in terms of the overall economy. And that's what these Albertans are thinking, too. We've had tremendous growth. It's, it's going to be a little tough to have it slow down, but um, it probably won't be as bad as many places. Once we get through it, we'll be okay. The government is hoping to rebound by 2010. Janet Dirks, CTV News, Calgary.